Question 10. Work out an estimate for the mean height of these trees. Now, I think to fully understand this question, you've got to properly understand what the table's telling us. The table gives information about the height of 50 trees. Now, 8 trees' height is between 0 metres high, well, greater than that 0, it's got to be something, but less than or equal to 4 metres. So somewhere between 0 and 4 metres. These 21 trees are somewhere above 4 up to and including 8 metres. Now how high exactly these 8 trees are we don't know. The best we can do is just assume that they are the midpoint. So we're assuming each of these 8 trees is exactly 2 metres high. Of course they won't be, there'll be something different, but that's why our answer is going to be an estimate. So we start off by working out each of these midpoints because that's how much we're, we're going to assume each of these batches of trees are equal to in height. So we're assuming 8 trees are 2 metres high, 21, meters are, 21 trees are 6 metres high, 12 trees are 10 metres high and so on. Okay, this column being the midpoint. Obviously, you can just see the midpoint. If you can't just see it, how do you work out the midpoint? Add the two together and halve it. 8 of 12 is 20. Half of 20 will be your 10. Anyway, so we're assuming 8 trees are 2 metres high. So how much height is that in total? 8 times 2 is 16. 21 times 6 is 1, 2, 6 and so on. So we then add up these batches of height to get a total height of the 50 trees of 396 meters. Remember that's an estimated height. So what's the mean height of these trees? The estimated mean is 396 meters spread across the 50 trees. So 396 divided by 50 gives us 7.92 meters. Now don't fall into the trap of rounding this answer because you think well it's an estimate it doesn't have to be that accurate. You must give this to uh, an exact value or a given degree of accuracy if the question said three decimal places whatever so don't go and round this remember this estimating comes from the fact of this assumption of midpoint height it's nothing to do with rounding your final answer so you must give your final answer as what exactly 396 is divided by 50 which is 7.92 meters